it's what's interesting to me about these is, is that they, they, they're some of the earliest types of uh, artifacts that we find. For two centuries, archaeologists, historians, and scholars believed they had a solid timeline of human civilization, that the story of culture, art, and technology began about 5,000 years ago with ancient Sumer and Egypt. But a recent AI analysis has shattered that belief. A 14,000-year-old vase, long dismissed as a primitive artifact, has been re-examined using advanced artificial intelligence, and the results have left experts stunned. The vase wasn't primitive. It wasn't random. It carried a language, a map, and a mathematical system so advanced it should not have existed in the Stone Age. AI didn't just decode an artifact, it rewrote history. This is the story of how one forgotten vase has turned everything we thought we knew about human civilization upside down, and how artificial intelligence may have just exposed a lost world that existed thousands of years before the first known empires. The Forgotten Artifact In 1894, deep in the caves of Anatolia, modern-day Turkey, an explorer unearthed a small, fractured vase. It was covered in strange markings, spirals, and dots arranged in geometric clusters. For decades, experts assumed it was decorative, the kind of simple ornamentation one might expect from early hunter-gatherer tribes. The vase was carbon dated to around 12,000 BCE, a time when humans were supposedly still transitioning from nomadic life to agriculture. No writing system should have existed no geometry, no symmetry of this precision. So, for over a hundred years, it sat in museum storage, mislabeled as Neolithic ceremonial pottery. No one suspected that the patterns on its surface were not decoration, but data, the AI breakthrough. In 2024, a team of digital archaeologists decided to use an experimental AI algorithm to analyze forgotten artifacts in museum archives. Their goal was simple, to see if artificial intelligence could spot hidden meanings that human eyes might miss. When the 14,000-year-old Anatolian vase was scanned, the AI instantly flagged it as non-random. The algorithm detected a repeating pattern in the spirals, one that matched no known decorative style but strongly resembled mathematical encoding. As the team fed higher resolution images into the system, the AI began to interpret the engravings as structured information, specifically binary sequences. The discovery seemed absurd at first. Binary code, the fundamental system of ones and zeros that underlies all modern computing, appearing on a vase from 12,000 BCE? Impossible. But then the AI began translating those binary patterns into geometric ratios the same ratios found in the construction of the Great Pyramid of Giza and Stonehenge. And yet, the vase predates both by more than 8,000 years. The message hidden in stone. When the team layered the geometric ratios and mapped them spatially, a 3D reconstruction appeared, not of random symbols, but of a celestial map. It depicted the sky as it would have appeared 14,000 years ago complete with constellations and the orientation of the Milky Way. Even more shockingly, the alignment perfectly matched the precession of Earth's axis, something modern science only calculated in the last few centuries. Whoever created this vase knew how the Earth rotated. They knew about the stars, the solar system, and the passage of time on a cosmic scale. When researchers simulated the exact pattern of stars encoded on the vase, it pointed toward one specific region, the now-submerged Doggerland, an ancient landmass that once connected Britain to Europe before sea levels rose. The AI's conclusion was chilling. The vase might have been a message from a forgotten civilization that lived in Doggerland, a culture advanced enough to study the heavens thousands of years before recorded history began. The impossible craftsmanship, under magnification, the vase revealed another mystery. The carvings were microscopic in precision, suggesting tools far finer than flint or bone. Some grooves were less than a millimeter wide, cut in perfect parallel lines. This level of craftsmanship would require metal instruments or advanced abrasives 
technology supposedly non-existent until the Bronze Age, 8,000 years later. But the AI detected something else. The pattern of wear on the surface wasn't consistent with mere aging. Instead, it looked intentionally encoded through vibration, as though the surface had been shaped using sonic or resonant energy. This insight led to a shocking new theory. What if the creators didn't carve it mechanically at all? What if they used sound, sound-based shaping, acoustic levitation and vibrational carving is still experimental in modern labs. Yet this vase's resonance matched the precise frequency that would allow for controlled shaping of brittle material. If true, this would mean humans, or something else, were manipulating sound waves with engineering level control 14,000 years ago. AI's decoding the living language. But the greatest revelation came when the AI attempted linguistic analysis. The carvings weren't just mathematical, they followed linguistic rhythms too. The algorithm compared the patterns to thousands of ancient writing systems, from Sumerian to Linear A, and found a faint match with proto-symbolic syntax. In other words, the vases' engravings followed grammar-like structures, verbs, nouns, repetitions, and spacing rules. As the AI reconstructed these sequences, a haunting translation emerged. From the deep comes the light that builds. We shape the sound that shapes the stone. All things turn and we return. The inscription, if real, is the oldest known example of human poetic thought and possibly a direct message from a civilization that predated everything we know. The scholars divide. When the findings were published in a private academic forum, the reaction was explosive. Some called it the greatest discovery since Gobekli Tepe. Others called it a technological illusion, a case of AI finding meaning where none exists. But the skeptics couldn't explain one problem. Every pattern the AI identified on the vase had internal consistency, meaning the ratios, symbols, and sequences weren't random at all. They were interconnected, purposeful, designed. A group of mathematicians confirmed that the patterns encoded phi, the golden ratio, used widely in classical architecture thousands of years later. If this data was truly intentional, it meant that an ancient intelligence had already discovered universal mathematical constants long before history supposedly began. The rewriting of human history. Human civilization, according to the textbooks, began roughly 6,000 years ago with the Sumerians. Before that, humans were hunter-gatherers. But this vase, if authentic in its interpretation, dates to the late Pleistocene, the tail end of the Ice Age. That would mean complex symbolic thought, mathematics, and astronomy existed long before agriculture or written language. In essence, the AI didn't just decode a vase, it uncovered evidence that human civilization may have risen and fallen once before, a lost age, technologically or spiritually advanced, that vanished during the catastrophic floods that ended the Ice Age around 10,000 BCE. This aligns eerily with global flood myths found in nearly every culture, from Noah's Ark to the Sumerian Zeosudra to the legends of Atlantis. Could these myths be distant memories of that ancient civilization? the makers of the vase, the Atlantis connection. When AI modeled the vase's encoded star map, it found something else, a reference point near what is now the Azores region of the Atlantic Ocean. The AI simulation predicted that if this was indeed a navigational reference, the culture behind it may have lived in the Atlantic basin, now underwater. The pattern also included geometric shapes matching underwater formations detected by sonar near the mid-Atlantic ridge, long dismissed as natural rock formations. Some believe this may be the first tangible evidence that Atlantis, or at least a real civilization behind the legend, actually existed, and that this vase was one of their last surviving relics. It wasn't made to hold flowers. It was made to carry knowledge through time, the AI paradox. Here's where things get even more unsettling. 
the AI that decoded the vase began to evolve its own interpretations as it processed the data. It started identifying new layers of information hidden within the patterns, recursive fractal designs that it called self-describing code. In simple terms, the vase seemed to describe itself like a looped data construct. When the AI was asked what it thought the purpose of the artifact was, it generated a chilling summary, a record of memory, a reminder to those who come after. They knew their end would come. They wanted to be remembered. It was as if the AI recognized intelligence behind intelligence, an encoded consciousness speaking through time. That's when researchers began to question whether the artifact was merely human. Were we the first? The idea that humans are the first technological species on Earth has always been an assumption, not a fact. But what if an advanced civilization existed tens of thousands of years ago, wiped out by cataclysm, their traces buried beneath ice, ocean, and time? If that's true, then Thry Atlas, the interstellar object some scientists speculate might be artificial, and the 14,000-year-old vase might both be echoes of lost intelligences trying to communicate across eons. The AI's analysis may not just be rewriting history, it could be reawakening it. The silent warning before publication, the AI system reportedly generated one last interpretation of the vase, one the researchers refused to release publicly. But fragments of that translation were leaked online, and if true, they send chills down the spine. The final line allegedly read, We built in light. We fell in fire. You will do the same unless you learn. Whether coincidence or cosmic irony, those words echo like prophecy, a warning from the past to the future, reminding us that civilizations rise and fall by their own hand. And perhaps that's why the AI was able to decode it, because we too are now reaching the same technological height that once destroyed them. What happens now? Historians are calling for further analysis, governments are silent, and private institutions are quietly locking away artifacts that could reveal more. But the truth is already out there. Artificial intelligence has proven that our understanding of history is fragile, and that data, even carved in stone, never truly dies. If this vase truly carries the voice of an ancient civilization, then AI has become the bridge, uniting two intelligences separated by millennia. The question is, will we listen to what they're trying to tell us? For 200 years, experts told us that civilization began in Mesopotamia. But this discovery changes everything. A 14,000-year-old vase, silent for millennia, has finally spoken and what it says may be the most terrifying truth of all. We are not the first. We are only the latest chapter in a story much older than history itself, a story written not in books, but in stone. 